Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. Just wanted to make sure that we said hello. We said we're going to be having an announcement every other day. So today's Friday. We just wanted to take you through a couple of things, let you see some spots in school. Uh, so you have an idea of what's happening as we're trying to keep things rolling here for most people, okay? So we're going to talk to a couple folks. I'll show you the process for everybody to sign in and how we get into school, and then hopefully we'll, uh, we'll give you a little update at the end. So let's go for a walk real quick, and we'll go see um, Mrs. Streeter and sign in, because anybody who comes into school who's a volunteer, this is what they have to do just so that you can see what's going on here. Come on. So at this point, everyone who comes in signs in, and they get to see Mrs. Streeter, and then we they head over to the nurse. We'll show you how that all works. Let's go see who's in the office and say hi to everybody. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Look who's Hello. here, Mr. Gammon, Mrs. Benedict, Mrs. Hello. Streeter. Hello. We miss you guys. <laughs> so then once you sign in, we just take a walk down. Come on, we'll go see the nurse. Today, the nurse is Mrs. Henneke. What we've been doing is... Um, rotating the nurses through so we have a nurse in the district each day but this is the the only building that's open right now so anybody who comes in to volunteer or anything anybody who comes in to help after they sign in with Mrs. Streeter or Mrs. Patterson she's also on a uh, alternating day they come in here to talk to Mrs. Henneke come on hi Mrs. Henneke good morning I need to have my temperature taken okay Do I pass? All right, I'm yes. healthy. All right, come on. I'll show you around what's, what's happening here. This has really become command central for um, the food distribution. We started this week with the Chromebook distribution. And also last week, Mr. Whittle started with the uh, Erla Books distribution. So the main room that everybody meets in every day is Mrs. Meyer's room. And in there is the vests and they clean the radios each day. We'll take a quick shot in there so you can see this is where people meet in the morning. Uh, we're a little bit early. They usually start in about uh, 20 minutes. But So they come in, they go to Mrs. Meyer's room, and then let's walk in the uh, cafeteria and I'll show you what we got going on. Morning, everybody. Everybody say hi. So this is the this is Mr. Whittle's uh, domain, and he, what he has here is he's had band instruments at one point in time. Now it's going with Chromebooks. Uh, Mr. Moulton's here with Mr. Hill. Uh, they're making sure the, the, the Chromebooks are clean and ready to go. You can see all the bags. Mr. Whittle's over there. He's the brains behind the distribution operation right now. And you can see our favorite constables over there. She's doing some work also. Mr. Whittle, how many uh, menu or how many meals are we serving a day um, on average right now? What are we up to? Yes, we just were under 900. Meals. Under 900. That's awesome. So 900 meals. People are driving through. I'll take you outside here in just a second. 900 meals go through, and then we're also doing Chromebooks. So. There's a lot of people working really hard to make sure that we're trying to make this as smooth of a transition to home instruction pieces as we can. Uh, there's going to be, like I told you on Wednesday, there's going to be burps and hiccups, and we're trying to figure those out every day to, to, to try to take care of people. So let's go to the kitchen. We'll see the ladies making some lunches, and I'll take you outside too. Come on. Morning, Constable. Good morning. How are you? Pretty good. good Missing everyone. Ya. <laughs> All right, so here's the here's the whole operation. Say hi, everybody. Hi. Morning. Morning. And these guys, what time do you guys get here in the morning? Eight. Eight, Eight o'clock. And yesterday, Mr. Whittle just told us you made 900 lunches. Yes. Holy macro. So that's right now, and they're running every day. Next week, we're going to be switching to a Monday, Wednesday, Friday distribution. So you can do the math. It's going to be 1,800 lunches they're going to have to make on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday to cover by everybody through the week. I'm going to take you through the cafeteria. We're going to go out the front door, and I'll show you the, the distribution um, lot and how that all works. And then we'll, uh, we'll do a little closing thing, and we'll get you out of here. Come on. Thank you, ladies. Thanks, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. 3,000 juices. Over 3,000 juices. Okay. So the, the people come in. We have deliveries that are happening. 
So these lunches are ready for deliveries and the van drivers come in first thing in the morning. They get out to start making deliveries before the traffic starts coming through. So that's what, what's happening now is they'll be pulling in probably in the next five or ten minutes to start getting the delivered lunches in their vans. Then they stop by uh, for Chromebooks and they also are taking Erla books to kids. So pretty big process going on here. Let's go outside real quick. stop in the morning. This one's here already. The rest will be here shortly. If you take a look over here, we have um, one-way traffic. I know you've seen these on the maps, but one-way traffic starts at Bulldog Boulevard. It comes around to these cones, and then on either side of this tent, there's a lane where people are picking up, whether it's Chromebooks or Earl Books or their lunches, and um, it's staffed by volunteers who come in every day and they got to make sure same thing we just did they make sure they're not sick and that they're healthy and they come out and they're running food between the cafeteria and the lines here so just wanted to give you a little flavor uh, make sure you got a chance to see some of the building uh, what we're going to do on Monday is we're going to be back inside the building but we'll be talking a little bit about the schedule that we have for the 612 for your academics it's on the website you can go see it right now um, each day has one core class and one encore class or one special area class and there's uh, activities throughout the whole week I can explain that to you you're more than welcome to go check it out on the website now but we'll, we'll be walking through that on Monday so that everybody's clear and again if you have any questions if you have any concerns please call we have a COVID number that you can dial and if you call the, the 346 4000 number that number will give you four choices and you can pick one of the choices to make sure that you get to the person that you need to get to. Okay, um, it's kind of ironic, we have the baseball field in the background um, with all these, all these cancellations, I kind of wish we heard uh, balls hitting bats and, and I wish kids were here. We miss you terrible, really do. Um, it's nice to have all these people around volunteering, but boy, without you guys here, it's just such a quiet place. We miss you, we love you, and God bless you guys and have a great weekend, okay? Take care.